everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you don't know who I am, my name is Ariana May and I am into plus size fashion. So for today I have a, another haul. It is a Rue 21 haul and I got a good selection of pieces. I think you guys are really going to enjoy this one. If you liked any of the items, they will be linked down in the description box. I think I got about 10 items. It's not numbered on my slip, but I'm pretty sure it was around 10 items. There are a few bralettes, a few bottoms, a few tops, and even like a kind of like a jacket thing. I'm super excited to try on these items for you guys because I do think that the selection I got is really great. I know I already said that, but I'm just, I'm super excited for this haul. There are a lot of really great pieces that I have been waiting for in the mail. It did take a while to get here, like two weeks, so not too long, but it was still long for me because I'm used to fast shipping, but that's just me I'm used to that so without further ado we can get into this video we might as well start with the item that made me get this haul so this item before I show it to you it was shown to me on Facebook it was like an ad and I saw this and I was like oh I really want that and I was like oh, but if I buy from Rue 21 I have to do a haul so then I was like do I really want to spend more money just for this one shirt and I was like yeah I do this shirt is the best shirt I have ever been shown to me on an ad before Rue 21 Facebook ad you killed it like you made me get this shirt I wanted it so bad so it is called the neon green goosebumps horror land graphic tee and I got it in a size, it doesn't say, a size XL, and it was originally $16.99. I think I got some sort of discount on it, but this is the top. It has this, like, Goosebumps logo, and the reason why I like this is because, one, it is this bright neon green, and I'm so into neons. Secondly, it's freaking Goosebumps. I used to grow up, I lived off of Goosebumps as a child. Like, it was a little creepy, but I loved it. I read the books, I watched a show, like, I watched the movies that are out. Oh, I love, love, love Goosebumps. And I really like this tee because you can definitely, like, see all the detail. And I do understand that sometimes Rue 21's quality for tees, like, the, this will rub off easily. So I'm hoping that's not the case with this one because I really do love it. If you like Goosebumps, definitely get this. This is only standard size, but honestly, the XL was huge on me and I could have sized down to a large, maybe even a medium, but that's just if I want it super tight. I do like the XL even though it's oversized because I can tie it and it's a perfect piece. The next items, let's go with this top. So this is in a size 2X and it is called the Plus Mint Ditzy Floral Print Puff Sleeve Peplum Top. And it was originally $18.99. I did not pay that price. So this is the top right here. I got it in a size 2X. It is that, like I said, very me mint color. It has beautiful ditzy floral design on it. And then it also kind of has like this embroidered detailing on the, the shoulders and also the sleeve. The sleeve is a little bit ruffly. And then also is a peplum because it cinches in at the waist right here. So it is stretchy it also has some buttons which i really do like that detailing they are not functional but they are a good design feature now this top is definitely way too big for me i honestly could have gotten a size 0x that's how massive it was on me which is really sad because i would have loved to wear this i just think it's so classic so cute and i do love the color and i do love florals um I don't think I'm going to exchange it for a different size because I'm too lazy to ship it back and then get it back. So I do think that if you're going to get this top, definitely size it down because a size 2X is too big for me. The next item I got, let's do these jeans. Uh, the jeans are called Plus Recycled Light Wash Blown Knee Straight Leg Jeans and they're in a size 20 and I got them for, well, the original price is 
So sorry, I had to read off that paper because this is a slip they gave to me and I want to be accurate with the prices that I give you. And sometimes Rue 21 doesn't have prices on their labels, especially if you buy from online. So is it a size 20? It is the brand Vanilla Star High Rise Straight and it is distressed. So let me show you the distressing. Very, as you can tell, the blown knee is there and there is that very nice like distressing detail. These were a pretty good length on me, but they were definitely too big, which makes me so sad. Yeah, if I had gotten these in an 18 or maybe even a 16 because of the stretch, these would have been the perfect jean. The quality is actually really nice, especially since it's recycled. It's thick, it's stretchy, and it's a really good pair of denim. It also has like that button closure, but it is hidden. So there's no zipper, it's just buttons, and then it has only one button really showing on it. And it does have nice deep front pockets and also the back pockets are pretty deep as well. I love this pair of denim. I wish I had gotten it in the right size. Like when will I learn to size down? Because for some reason Rue 21's sizing is like sometimes it's too big, sometimes it's too small, and sometimes it's just right. So if I had known that these were going to be too big, I definitely would have sized down because this is a perfect pair of denim. And if you get this in your correct size, you will love these, I promise. The next item is this hoodie. So this is, let me get my little slip here. It is the Plus Black Nickelodeon Cropped Graphic Hoodie. I got this in a size 2X and it was originally $32.99. I did not pay that price. So it is cropped and I love my crop hoodies, except especially for the winter time. It has this Nickelodeon detail here and then it has some of the OG Nick characters as you can see. So I got this for one of two reasons. One, I love Nickelodeon. Well, yeah, obviously. And two, I freaking love Rugrats. I love Chucky. If you've been on my channel, you know that I just will buy anything Rugrats themed. And also the hood on this look at it look at the freaking hood it's freaking reptar that is a dope ass hood it is long sleeve with that traditional sweatshirt cuffed the material is actually really thick and it has kind of like a soft inner which i really do enjoy and then i think that the neon orange drawstring really ties in the whole piece and i think that a size 2x was actually a really good size to get it in the next piece i have for you guys is a pair of cargo pants this is called the Plus Black Belted Cargo Pants. They're originally $36.99 and I got them in a size 2X. They are from the brand Almost Famous and they are very stretchy and they also have this nice buckle. And I think this belt is so cute. I've never really seen a belt like this before, but I think it really just kind of ties the whole look together. It's a zipper closure and it also has a one button and these pants were big on me for one I should have got these in a size 1x but they were also really high-waisted so if you like high-waisted pants this is the perfect pair of pants to get because the waist on these was freaking high like a little too high for my liking there was a lot of gaping for me but that is probably just because I got the wrong size and it is a traditional jogger style with the tapered in leg which does stretch if you have thicker ankles it also since it is that cargo pant it has a bunch of really thick deep pockets which i do enjoy the quality on this is amazing especially for rue 21 i do appreciate the quality they have there i know it's fast fashion so the quality isn't the best but for some reason whenever i get it it just feels nice to me the next item before we get into bralettes is this hoodie, or it's not really a hoodie, it is called the Plus Black Mesh Half Zip Windbreaker. It was originally $24.99 and I got it in a size 2X. So it is obviously this black windbreaker. It has a quarter zip on the front with this little circular zipper and then it also has a mesh bottom so that like if you were to just wear a sports bra underneath it your whole stomach would be out it has cuffed stretchy sleeves and they're long sleeve and it is in that um windbreaker material so it does make that sound when it moves if you can hear that 
I absolutely love this. I do think maybe it was a size too big. I really need to get used to her sizing. It's just I keep being thrown off. But I do like this and I will be keeping it. And I think that it's a really great piece. And I will be getting a lot of wear out of this. I really do enjoy this. Sometimes I just want to go out wearing a sports bra. But then I feel like people are going to be like, oh my god, why is she just wearing a sports bra? You know what, when I work out. Because I am plus size and that is just kind of the mentality people have. So being able to have this is coverage, but it's also breathable and movable and like there's a lot of ventilation going in with the mesh material. So I bought four bralettes. I have been on the hunt for some lined bralettes. I do buy a lot of my bralettes from Torrid because they have nice bralettes, but they're not lined and I've been, I hate wearing strapless bras with their bralettes. So I've been on the hunt for some nice lightly lined bralettes and I know that I have a few from Rue 21 before that are really good. Unfortunately, I need to figure out my sizing. I got all of these bralettes in a size 1X, but they're still big on me, which is crazy because I'm pretty much a 1X, like, top size everywhere. Like, and I don't know why Rue 21 is any different. And also, it doesn't really make my chest look better. I wish I had, like, a lightly lined push-up bralette, but I feel like that's never going to happen. Like, when is com when are companies going to start doing that? I don't, I don't understand. But this is the first bralette I got, and it is called the plus light pink double v-neck bralette and then it's funny because the color says light purple but the title says light pink and it was originally $12.99 I think I did pay that price and it is this it looks like this and it has kind of like a crochet floral detail with the lightly lined like I said it was going to have and then the bottom is kind of like a long line and it has a few inches of that floral detailing. I do like this bralette a lot. The cups are removable so if you don't want them you can definitely remove them and I think that I will be keeping this even though it's a little big because I do want some more bralette options in my closet. The next bralette I got was the plus black double v-neck bralette. I think it is in that same floral, I think it's the same print as the purple one, but it's just black. So again, it has that lightly lined cup and then it has removable pads and it also has that floral lace detailing on it as well as that few inches of the detailing on the bottom. I do like this bralette. I think it's very cute and I love that it is a double v-neck because it kind of gives it that like, I just don't know. The V back is really nice when it comes to items. And I do like this and I think it will pair nicely under tube tops, which is my hope. The next bralette I got is called the Plus Burnt Orange Crisscross Crochet Bralette. It is a originally $12.99 and again, I got this in a size 1X. So it is this beautiful, oh my gosh, burnt orange color which I absolutely adore and it has a crisscross racer back at the on the back obviously I just said that it is lightly lined and padded and it has removable cups so you can take them out it is this gorgeous like floral lace again like the other bras and they are it has also this little bottom few inches of floral detailing as well which I really enjoy in bralettes. I do love long line bralettes. See like my perfect bralette would be long line, push up, lightly lined. I think that's it, yeah. I don't know, maybe something else. The last item I have and the last bralette is called the Plus Yellow Daisy Crochet X Back Bralette and it was originally $14.99. So this is actually super cute and it's definitely crochet and not lace because you can tell that the knitting on this is kind of like, you can look at it, see? It has floral print on it, but it also has like polka dots kind of. It has this nice crisscross back, which is kind of hard to show you in this thing, but it is a crisscross. And then it has adjustable straps, which is really nice. It also has a smocked stretchy back and it the front of it is just super cute the way that it looks and I do like the long line crochet detailing on it I wish that I got this in a smaller size because then it would be perfect it's so freaking cute I love the color and I love the design 
So that is the official end of this video. If you like this video, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. If you like me and my personality, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications. I post two times a week and I'm aiming for three. If you have any questions or comments, please go ahead and leave them in the comment box. Since I do have a small channel, I do look at my comments. And thank you so much for watching. I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye!